Imagine a creature so resilient. It can withstand temperatures near absolute zero, intense radiation, and even the vacuum of space. Meet the Todigrade, a microscopic water bear found just about everywhere on Earth, from moss and lichen to the deep ocean. Todigrades may not be the main model organism anymore, but they offer valuable insights into animal physiology and simplicity. Their translucent bodies, barely visible to the naked eye, hold surprisingly complex anatomy, including digestive systems, muscles, and even a brain and nervous system. This simplicity makes them ideal for educational purposes, showcasing the fundamentals of life within their diminutive frames. Despite their miniature size, todigrades move with deliberate grace, propelled by short, stout legs adorned with unique claws. These claws vary from bear-like paws to medieval weaponry, reflecting the diversity of the over 1,000 known species. Their flexible cuticles, shed as they grow, place them within the ectozoa lineage, alongside nematodes and arthropods. Unlike most creatures, Todigrades are renowned for their extraordinary ability to exist in three distinct states of being, active, anoxobiosis, and cryptobiosis. The active state is where the todigrades come alive, quite literally. In this phase, they roam their miniature worlds, driven by a surprisingly complex internal machinery. Muscles propel them on stubby legs, their microscopic claws grappling with moss fibers and lichen strands. Tiny digestive systems process meals of bacteria and algae, while a simple yet functional nervous system governs their movements. This is where they reproduce, laying eggs nestled amongst the verdant tapestry of their habitat. It is a life seemingly ordinary, yet within their translucent bodies lies the potential for extraordinary transitions. The first shift occurs when oxygen windles, triggering the entry into anoxobiosis. As their environment dries, depriving them of the life-giving gas, todigrades activate a survival protocol. Their bodies inflate, resembling miniature Michelin men, and they enter a floating state. This aerial journey isn't a desperate flailing, but a calculated move. Water droplets clinging to their plump forms become life rafts, carrying them on the wind until they land in a more hospitable environment. Upon rehydration, the todigrades deflate, their internal machinery whirring back to life, resuming their active existence as if nothing had happened. But the true depths of their resilience lie in the realm of cryptobiosis, as their world parches, transforming from verdant oasis to dusty wasteland. Todigrades enter a suspended animation unlike any other. They shrivel to a mere fraction of their size, their bodies contorting into tons, armored capsules resembling desiccated raisins. In this state, they lose up to 97% of their body water, their metabolism grinding to a near halt. They can withstand temperatures near absolute zero, scorching heat, crushing pressures, and even the unforgiving vacuum of space. In this state, time loses its grip, and life becomes a flicker held in amber, waiting for the spark of rehydration. When rain falls, or dew gathers, the tons awaken. Water seeps back into their dehydrated cells, plumping them up and reactivating their dormant systems. Muscles twitch, digestive tracts gurgle, and within hours, these tiny titans of endurance return to their active state, as if resurrected from the dust. In 2007, these tiny titans became the first multicellular organisms to survive space, exposed to the vacuum, radiation, and scorching temperatures of the void. They returned to Earth, rehydrated, and continued their lives, an astonishing testament to their resilience. But how do they do it? Scientists believe the answer lies in several factors. Effective DNA repair systems that combat environmental damage, powerful osmoregulation to maintain internal balance, and perhaps even unique proteins that protect their cells. 
Blasting Todd degrades with radiation shattered their DNA, yet they magically repaired it. Scientists have discovered that they crank up DNA repair genes some 300-fold. These boosted genes tackle the exact damage radiation causes, suggesting Todd degrades have a built-in DNA damage alarm and repair kit. This resilient dance with DNA could rewrite our understanding of life, holding secrets to protecting organs and extending lifespans. The ubiquity of tardigrades is another fascinating aspect. Wind bontons, barely discernible from dust particles, can journey vast distances, waiting for suitable landing sites. Their parthenogenesis and hermaphroditic abilities further enhance their colonizing potential allowing single individuals to establish new populations. Despite over 1,000 documented species, researchers believe many more remain undiscovered, especially in non-terrestrial environments. Each newly discovered species, each new insight into their survival mechanisms, adds another chapter to the remarkable story of tardigrades. These tiny water bears inspire us with their resilience, remind us of the boundless ingenuity of nature and fuel the fire of scientific discovery.